Hello everyone and welcome to the next episode of Pokemon Black. Alright then, well I almost forgot to do something really quick. Cause I had a battle, I actually got to have a battle with 13 orange ones last night and Daniel the Hobble the Horror. However, the fight between me and Daniel did not end well. His Pokemon are too strong for me so far. So I'll have to just to show you the battle I had with 13 orange ones. And of course my Pokemon were in a little bit of a lower level level by then. Well, this was all just last night, so nothing much changed, I guess. Alright, so he sends out, sends out his Emboar, which is called Bacon. And I send out City Life, which is at level 48. Alright, he does pretty well, especially with his uh, Bacon. Because when he uses Flame Charge, he actually kills Siggy Life in one single hit. Which is quite a surprise. However, it's not really surprising, especially since Bacon's level 55 and Siggy Life was level 48. So I go and send out Superior just for the fun of it, like Starter versus Starter. And I use Strength to finish out the Emboa. So the Emboa goes down. And he sends out, uh, um, oh yeah, the Aud Audacious is why I named it. I guess that's why I named it. So I go and send out Dark Draco, which is not really Dark Draco. It's actually Itachi in disguise. Or Zorok, or whatever you want to call him. So... So the 13 orange ones Pokemon uses take take down and causes the Zorark to show his true form. So I go ahead and use Night Slash and hit, and destroy the Audacious. Audacious or I have no idea what it's called. So he sends out his Buffalo or Buffalo both fallen. I think that's what it's called. Um anyway. I go and use foul play because the higher the attack stats of that Pokemon, the greater the attack. So I figured I can use that attack for, quick, for uh, one hit, but that didn't really work. So I end up killing Zorark and I send out Bowser. So I use Shell Smash, so I can, even though it drops the defense and special defense capabilities, it does increase the attack, special attack, and speed sharply. So pretty much I can kill anything with one single hit, or maybe more than one single hit. With Waterfall, Surf, Crunch, any of those moves I do now. But I know pretty soon Bowser's going to forget how to use Crunch and then I'm going to switch it with Dive. So it's mostly going to know Water type attacks. And I'll probably do a walkthrough for the Underwater Ruins. To show you all around, but to see what it's like underwater. Okay, so I destroyed the Buffalo. And he sends out Litwick. And I gotta say, Litwick is one of my favorite Pokemon because it's so well, uh, it's so cool looking and it's also cute. But it's too bad he didn't get to evolve into a Lampent or a Shend Chandelier or whatever it's called. Then he sends out what he calls Piffy, which is a Piddle, and it still has a lot of training to go through. So pretty much the rest of his Pokemon get killed with one single hit. Especially Chip, because it's a level 2, uh, what's it called again? Well, anyway, that takes care of the battle between me and 13 orange ones. And I guess I'll call it quits with that one for now. So please subscribe, add the favorites, press the like button, and I'll see you all in the next episode of Pokemon Black. Alright then, we'll see ya.